Hi, um, my name is Maria Rothenberg. Today I'm going to show you how you can create your own account in the business of fashion. So business of fashion, or sometimes people call it BOF, is a website, an online magazine that has all the information you want to know about the fashion industry, like what's happening right now. And it's a great resource for you guys to use. You'll know, you'll have like the pulse of what's happening in the industry and you'll be able to discuss it with your professors or your peers and also like people that you meet in the industry. So you'll really know what's going on. So it's a great habit to get into reading about your industry every day in the paper. And this is a great resource. Like I said, FIT, you have a free subscription. Um, you just have to register for it. So I'm gonna show you how to do that. So let's go take a look. Okay, so now I'm going to show you how you can create your own Business of Fashion account. And I'm going to take you right up here to the browser. I just opened up a page in Chrome. You're just going to type in this. You're going to type in fitnyc.edu slash library slash databases. This is the easiest way to get to Business of Fashion. Okay? And then I'm just going to click Enter and it takes me to the page that I want. So databases are essentially, they are websites that FIT pays a subscription fee for, and you, then you have access, like magically you have access to all this amazing content that normally people would have to pay for. But you guys, because you're students here at FIT or you're affiliated with FIT um, in some way where you teach or something, then you have access too until you graduate. <laughs> um, Okay, so I'm going to click on B, right, for Business of Fashion. Scroll down here. There it is. I'm not going to click on this yet. I've never used this before. So, therefore, I will click on the plus sign. And you, I recommend that you do this for any website that you have never used before um, on our database list. Always check it and it will tell you information about the database that's important. So in this case, you have to create your own account so you have access. All right, so I'm gonna click on this and it takes me to this page. So you will be filling this out with your name, uh, last name, and your FIT email. You'll create a password. You have the option to subscribe or not to the Daily Digest. I find this really convenient because while I'm waiting for the subway to come to work, I can just, you know, like read the news that's in my inbox and I don't even have to uh, log in. So, but that's optional. Now I'm gonna go over here and log in because I have my own account. Put my email in. Okay, and then my password. And this is the password that I made up. And here we are. This is the home page. We have all the latest news that's happening in your industry. So right now we have like August 9th, August 9th, August 8th. So we have like this is very big news for today. We come down, we can see what else is happening, an article that we like. So for example, I'm gonna go ahead and click on this one, the hunt for an easy way to recycle old clothes. <laughs> Definitely could use that information. So um, there's of course a lot on here. Um, so you can focus on different areas that you might be interested in or might be more focused towards your classes. I love how sustainability has just become now like so normalized. That's not even really a cool trend anymore. It's kind of embedded in all of our industry. Now, if you want to get a more deep dive into things, if you want to look at luxury, okay, or technology, again, we have the very latest news that you can read. It's super important that with these articles, you'll notice that, I'm just going to go ahead and click on this one. They'll have the date, okay, and also the author. So you can see who this person is that's writing about this. So I could click on that name, and then it's going to show me some of the other articles this person wrote, and I can find out a little bit about them. So that's really important, right? You want to know something about the source that wrote the article. And all of that is readily available here at Business of Fashion. You'll never see something that doesn't have an author. You won't see anything that doesn't have a date. So that's very important. So over here, we have our different categories. Like I said, you could do any of these if you want to look at beauty or global markets, fashion week. And then up here we have jobs. 
So if you are interested in seeing what is in your industry for jobs, what the qualifications are, maybe you're looking for something right now, then you have you know, you have access to this. Please feel free to email me if you have any questions. I hope you have a great semester and take care. Happy reading.